The next role we're going to hear on the American photo player is called the Cuckoo Waltz, or in German, the Cuck Cuck Walzer. Now, this role has a particular uh, place in my heart because Mr. Marvin Hatley, who arranged and performed most of the music that you hear, if not all the music, uh, for Laurel and Hardy films and the R. Gang films, along with Charlie Chase and Thelma Todd, uh, he actually came up to the house one day and uh, wanted to play the photo player. And when he came in, he looked at the machine and he started crying. And I thought, oh my God, what did I do now? And I said, is everything all right, Mr. Hatley? And he said, well, I, he excused himself. He was very polite. And he said that he hadn't seen one of these machines since he was a little boy. And that his mother used to play one in a theater. And since they were too poor to afford a babysitter, she would bring him to the silent movie theater and put a little rocking chair in front of one of the great cabinets he said, I would sit before this great speaker and all this music would well out at me. And I'd look over and I'd watch my mother intently watching the screen as she was pulling the chords. Now, that, that's, that makes it an American photo player because only American use the pull chords, sometimes, refer, sometimes referred to as a, a cow player or cow puller. So, Mr. Hatley couldn't wait to uh, play the machine. And it's interesting because in some small way, it would be nice to think that American Photo Player was responsible for forming this man's attitude in music, uh, who later <clears throat> went on to not only uh, create music for Topper and other films, but films that we all know and love, The R Gang, Laurel and Hardy, Charlie Chase. And they said as soon as he was old enough to wear pants, he sat in the front row so he could listen to the music. And I guess then eventually played. So without further ado, we're going, this is for you, Marvin. This is the Cuckoo Waltz. He said that this, this piece of music was used by uh, the MGM Orchestra in, uh, for their early 1929 uh, musical uh, films, musical sound films. Uh, there was no dialogue. It was merely sound effects and music. And he heard this in one of the tracks and later based his uh, Laurel and Hardy theme song on this. The Cuckoo Valser.